Hi, this is Pastor Gene Kim from San Jose Bible Baptist Church. So uh, let me zoom back here. This is like so close. Boo, doo, 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 doo. Okay, there we go. So we're doing an all-night prayer meeting. So right now it's, uh, can you stick out your watch, brother? Uh, how, how far are we doing? We're doing 3.11. 3.11 11 a.m. Hey, bless God. So uh, we started out with 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So we start out with 7. And uh, because uh, we're taking shifts and turns in prayer meeting, and because this is a first time uh, for new members, uh, I told them that if they can't hang out, uh, they can sleep, you know. So we had some rooms set up for them where they can sleep in the middle. But uh, those, who, uh, those who want to stick it up all night, they can stick with me. So, so far we got, uh, let's see, Brother Robert here. Brother Robert's hey, sticking it out. How you doing? And then, Scott. now this is a blessing. This is Juanito. Hey. This is only his third visit. Third visit. And then uh, he's new to the uh, Bible-believing church Woo! as well. But yeah. he was... He wanted to join us for an all-night prayer meeting, and he stuck it out. That's, that's a blessing. So he definitely has courage, yeah, so in his shirt. So he definitely has courage. I know. <laughs> Whereas this guy, he's going to be a warrior, yeah, prayer yeah, warrior. Prayer so, warrior. Hey, wake up. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> <laughs> so Brother Ralph just got baptized tonight. Yes. So hey, that's a blessing. Guy. We just baptized him tonight. Yep. And uh, he actually, I didn't expect uh, him to be able to stay this far, actually, tonight. Wow. So... So <laughs> I didn't mean that. I didn't mean that much. Yeah, but he wants to stick. Uh, he wants to stick out around as much as he can. And so far, I'm just wow. It's already three. Yeah, maybe he might. Uh, we have less than three hours, so he might stay all night. Who knows? So we'll see what happen. But uh, we're we're definitely gonna pull through, you know. And then uh, we only have less than three hours to do this all night prayer thing. So we've been praying all the prayer requests within our church. And uh, our goal is to pray also for uh, the, God's revival within our revival meeting we're going to have soon and that the Lord will do something within our world yeah. to use Bible-believing ministers. And then we're also going to be praying for uh, Bible-believing missionaries. And then the la uh, another thing we're going to be praying for is Bible-believing Christians around the world. So we're going to pray for all of the people around the world. That's our goal. So uh, we're going to do this in an all-night prayer meeting manner. All right. So... I don't know if the Lord's going to answer in a mighty way, but uh, that's what we're going to do tonight. Okay, uh, we'll log in a little later. So this is Pastor Gene Kim from San Jose Bio Baptist Church. We just, uh, we're wrapping up our all night prayer meeting. We're going to do it one more time, but I just want to encourage the Bible believing missionaries out there. We pray for all of you tonight yeah. we went through the list as well we named through the list of bible baptist missions and for the people who are not listed in there we just uh simply lifted uh, lifted you guys up to in prayer and asked the lord to met, take care of all the ones who are not even in the list so we did an all-night prayer meeting for you guys we love all you bible believing missionaries please don't give up the fight stay strong in the lord and then also we prayed for a lot of things in our church needs and then for lost souls, uh, especially in the regions where you Bible-believing missionaries are at. And uh, we're now about to pray for every single Bible-believing Christian around the world. We're going to wrap up with that one. We also pray for the Lord's Holy Spirit power to fill within all of us so that we can start to do some things in this world. So, hey, um, I don't know what's going to happen after this, but we'll see how, hopefully the Lord will start moving in and we see some answers to prayer after this. All right. Lord bless you all. Good night. Baptism, of Brother Ralph. Yeah. Amen. Amen. Hey, brother in Christ, one of us. Amen. Amen. And all believer too. Yes, Amen. Brother, have you, with the repentant and believing heart, confessed to the Lord Jesus Christ for your salvation? Yes. Amen. Upon your profession, my brother, I baptize you in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Ghost. Buried with Him in baptism. Bless God. Congratulations, brother. Get him. Oh, now I get to sit in there. <laughs> All right, so that Ralph doesn't stay there long enough and we can get out of here. Uh, brother Tom, can you close the baptism with the word? So which are you choosing, Christians, huh? Which are you choosing? 
Throughout Joshua, we see that there's all this military conquest, right? The, 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 the children of Israel, they have to go through all of these battles to get there. And uh, being premillennialists, right, we're not the ones who are going to do the battle, right? We know that our, our Savior is going to come down and do the next battle. But there are some things, right, just as we learned before, there are some things we have to fight for. Our faith overcome the world. And how do we get that faith, Christian? Faith cometh by hearing, and hearing by the Word, word of God. God. By the Word of God, and not by your own flesh. Come not on. by what you think, not by what you want God to say. By the Word of God. And that's the only way we'll Amen. ever be saved. Amen. That's the only way we should preach. It's the only thing that matters in this world is the Word of God and what He's done for us. Amen. So I stand here today, Christians, and I tell you, if you haven't got that victory, if you haven't overcome your flesh, Come on. if you haven't overcome your vile tongue, Come on. your feet that are swift to move in unrighteousness, your froward mouth, oh. all of these things that Come you're on. doing and you're hiding from the church, if you haven't overcome Come these on. things, you need to come, and you need to get on the altar, and you need to ask for help for someone who's never lost. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who, <laughs> That's you. The altar call is open, every head bowed, and every eye shut.